Oh, today, we're back in House Flipper. We're about to flip this house. Watch. <laughs> flip that. Yeah, I'm rich now. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am right now one of the richest people in this game. All right. I have got $285,000 on my account balance, which is a lot of dollar bills. All right. Dollar. <laughs> so in this game, you can buy houses, fix them up, and sell them for profit. Ladies and gentlemen, I am about to buy the most expensive house available in House Flipper. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so this house is for sale for $279,000. It is 280 square meters big, which is like maybe uh, 3,000 square feet. But I, let's, let's use Google for that. Oh my God, I guessed it correctly. 3,035 square feet. The area of the house is about 10,000 square feet. So ladies and gentlemen, let's buy this property and fix it up. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. This is a mansion. Uh, this is gonna take some time. I wanna sell this house with at least $100,000 in profit. So we're gonna start off with cleaning this place. Let's clean the outside first, all right? And uh, I've maxed everything out, so it, sh it shouldn't take too long. Look at this. Oh, it's going so quite nice and fast. Sometimes I wonder, you know, what if I just clean the outside of the house and then sell it? Do I make profit then? Wait, sh should we check that out, actually? There we go. I just cleaned everything on the outside. I bought this place for $179,000. I'm just wondering, what could we sell it for? 272! Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> 275? 276? I think I bought it for 79. Yeah, I did. So we're already making profit by only cleaning the outside. This must be a glitch. This must be a glitch, guys. I've been working on this house for 54 seconds. And we've already made $10,000. Oh my god! $14,000 profit. Let's negotiate the offer. Let's add an extra six grand. Negotiate. Come on. All right. We can accept your proposal. Wait, what? $21,000 profit! Okay, we're gonna sell it. Two minutes later, we now have an account balance of $306,000. <laughs> That's kind of insane. We didn't even have to fix it up. I guess I found a glitch here, right? Should we try it again? What if we buy the $188,000 property? This is the second most expensive house in the entire game. Fix it up just a little bit and try and sell it. This one's actually a little bit dirtier, I feel. Wow, this one's even got a pool. I, I mean, this one looks bigger than the other one for some odd reason, and it's not even dirty. Oh my goodness. So someone's had a rough time here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's clean this up. I love how we didn't have to do anything to the previous property just to make some profit. We just cleaned it for 54 seconds and we made $20,000 off that. Guys, this is a great idea. I'm gonna become the richest man in House Flipper, which I pretty much already was. This is a great tutorial on how to get rich. You're welcome, everyone. You're welcome. This place is perfect already. Let's sell it. I worked on this one for two minutes instead of one. Oh, okay. We're starting a little low here. I bought the place for 188. I, I need to make at least 200, right? They're giving me a hard time. I I still haven't made more. 183. Oh, 100. And come on, come on. 88. Okay. $16 in profit. Oh, 11,000 in profit. $15,000 in profit. Let's negotiate the offer. Add another five grand to it. So we have $20,000 in profit. And let's sell this place. All right. We accept your proposal. Thank you, sir. $21,000 profit. Rolling in the dollar bills. All right. So I have a great idea, guys. How about we buy all these places, cleaning up just a little bit, and then we build our own house in a bit. That's a good idea. Okay. Bought another property. This one was around 180, I believe. I don't see anything dirty on the outside. It actually looks quite clean and it's quite massive. I don't like the pink though. Is this dirt? No, that's not dirt. That's just a shade. Uh, let's have a look inside. Is there anything we need to do? This house is beautiful. Oh, we got a leakage here. Okay, we'll fix the leakage and then we'll sell the place. Making dollar bills. There we go, leakage done. Is there another leakage anywhere? You hear another leakage. Yeah, another leakage over here. All right, fixed all the leakages. Everything is clean and well taken care of. All we gotta do now is sell the place for some dollar bills. Start auction, come on. We bought it for 144. We spent one minute on it. Let's see if we can sell for 166. That'll be a good price. Come on, I really do not wanna lose money on this place. All right, 136, we're still not in profit. 138, ooh, we got Smoth's family. I just sold a house to this guy. 140, we're still not making profit. 143, come on, this must be profit now. What, oh, we got $2,000 in profit, which is not great. Let's uh, negotiate the offer, add another $5,000 to it. Hopefully they'll buy it and we'll have $6,000. Yes, $7,000 in profit. Boys, rolling in dollars. 
Rolling in dollars! Ladies and gentlemen, this is the ultimate tutorial on how to get rich in life, alright? Alright guys, we have another one here, Uncle's Bunker! Let's, uh, let's go and check out this bunker. I have a new idea here. Instead of just cleaning the outside, how about we try and sell all the furniture inside of this guy's house? Is it even dirty on the outside? I think it looks kind, kind of dirty, yep. So instead of only cleaning it, we're also going to sell all the furniture that this guy- Oh, look at this glitch. <laughs> But anyway, we're gonna sell all the furniture that this guy has, and hopefully, we'll still end up making profit, guys. I mean, I don't know if we will, but that's why we are experimenting this new thing, alright? So first, we always start with cleaning the outside. Looking very nice and precious. Mm-hmm. Oh, what's this? Ew, there's cockroaches! Alright, let's just get inside and have a look what this place is all about. So, we're just gonna completely empty this place. Let's pick up all the trash, alright? We're gonna clean the floor. How do I clean this? We, we gotta vacuum these guys? Okay. <laughs> I'm, so, ugh, I'm sorry, buddies. I'm sorry. My vacuum is your new home. <laughs> I bet they like it down there. It's nice and windy. It's like a wind tunnel. All right, so we're gonna sell everything, like I said. Just sell everything. Oh my god. We're making so much money off that. So I don't know if we're still in profit after, but we'll have a look. Because they might give a lower offer to the place if there's no furniture in, but honestly, I don't know. This this game is full of surprises to me. All right, sell the carpet. $15. Sell this thing. This is a nice one. $171. Yo, I'll take it for that price, I gotta say. That's a good price. Are there more cockroaches? Oh, no. I'm sorry, guys. Guys, I am so sorry, but I've got more friends inside of this thing, so how about y'all hang out together, alright? But just don't make any babies, because that will be really weird inside my vacuum. Gotta be honest, that's weird. This is a nasty bathroom. Do we leave the toilet? I guess we'll leave it. Oh, we'll sell it. Okay, I didn't know we could sell the toilet, but I guess we can. Sell the shower for 151! <laughs> this is so strange, guys. We're selling everything. We're making so much money. Whee! All the lights. Oh, maybe the door as well. Yeah, let's let's sell all the doors. Great idea. I'm not sure if they count as rooms. Yeah, they still do. So if my theory is correct, the game doesn't really care whether there's furniture in there or anything about doors. They don't they don't care about it. They're gonna give me a high offer anyway. All right, dispose all these things. Sell the bed, everything we have. Okay, and then we just clean it up real quick. Oh, we're not gonna clean the windows. I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. Let's take, that takes so much time. There we go, another room has been cleaned. Oh, we forgot to sell the light. Thank you. Oh, you guys as well. Thank you for your money. Thank you, guys. Next room. <laughs> Man, I really wonder how much money we're gonna make off this thing. Okay, clean it all up. We're going quick, guys. We're going real quick. I think we have some more dirt on here. Some more dirt here. Nice. We gotta clean everything properly, all right? Nothing can be dirty. Think about them dollars. Think about them dollar bills. All right. Good, good, good. So we got a basement here. Hello there, little basement. How you doing? This is a nice little basement. Anything secret? No, nope, nothing secret. Oh! Wait, what? The fallout shelter? Are you kidding? That's insane! We have like a secret room down here. I mean, I'd buy this place. You could make some awesome gaming rooms in here. Sell this door. Oh! And this one. Oh, hello. <laughs> hey guys. Oh, there's a ladder? Wait, what? Whoa! How did I not see this cleaning out this place? <laughs> That's awesome! Alright, we're gonna continue cleaning everything. Dispose everything, sell everything, and hopefully we'll make profit, guys. I think the game kind of looks at, like, how much time you spend on it, and kind of if you did anything to it. And if you did anything, then they're, they're fine, then, then it's profit. All right, we gotta sell these guys. There you go. Clean up the floors and the walls, and then I think the fallout shelter, which is not a fallout shelter anymore, is done. Can also sell these lights real quick. Any money is money, guys. Money is money. A dollar bill is a dollar bill. There you go. I think everything is clean. Even though it doesn't look very clean, it is. All right? It is clean. Nice. We're done. We're done with the fallout shelter. Let's go back up. We need to sell this door. And I think... <laughs> I think that's it for this house. So the question is... Will we sell this property with an insane profit margin when doing nothing, literally cleaning up the place? I bought the place for $131,000. I've been working on it for eight minutes, and my current budget is $207. It doesn't tell me how much money I made off selling all the things, but I'm gonna guess around $2,000. We're starting off the auction. Lone Wolf says, Sofa, there is none. What? $30,000 profit? Um, uh, sure. <laughs> We just made $30,000 of doing nothing! Well, we did something, but, uh, I mean, like... <laughs> 
We got rid of everything. How about we get rid of everything in this house as well? We don't need anything, all right? We don't need anything. You can't actually shower or take a poop in this game. We don't need all these toilets and showers. We're good, man. This is how you make dollar bills, guys. Just live without anything. It's a good idea. You can sell everything except for the laptop. So uh, we're gonna do that. There we go. We've got a couple more houses to do. Uh, we got a burned house. We got a house with uninvited guests. I guess there's ghosts in there. Uh, we've got a uh, home in a car, a home admin legends, and a many generations home. A house that is hiding something. Maybe we should go check out that one. Uh, an old house with a bunker, a garage with a bunker. Let's check out this one. $93,000 for a house that is hiding something. We're gonna check it out and hopefully sell it with profit and find something that it's hiding. Cause I, I don't know what's hiding. But first, let's clean it all up on the outside. We got some graffiti. Uh, we got some dirty windows. We're actually not bothering with those because they just take way too long to clean up. They can do that themselves once they buy the place. Am I right? I think I'm right. So wiping all the graffiti away is working like a charm. There you go. I think the outside's pretty much clean. Apart from the front door, of course. Very nicely done. Man, this game's so funny. You can literally sell all the doors, all the furniture, and make a ton of money. All right, let's uh, get rid of all the trash. Quite importante. There you go, all the trash is pretty much gone. Sell all the tables and chairs, kitchen parts. There we go, oh, we got another cupboard over here. Uh, the doors, okay. Oh, we got a little, we got a little basement. This is a bathroom. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's, uh, let's clean this all up real quick. Actually, let's get rid of the lights first. There we go, let's clean it all up. Oh, we forgot about this room. There's a bedroom here as well. Nice bed. $130. Dude, we should buy houses in real life. I should make a series on buying houses in real life and selling it for profit. That'd be insane. <laughs> Just buying it and getting rid of all the furniture and then sell the place. I don't, I don't think that's profitable. All right, bathroom clean, living room clean, bedroom clean. All we got to clean up now is the basement area, which uh, is a bit of a mess, I must say. All right, let's pick up all the trash. There we go. Very nice. I love how quick that goes. Look, it picks up all the boxes at once. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Sell all the objects. There you go. What is this? Assemble? Oh, I've never seen this before. This is like an electricity thing or something? What do we assemble? Okay, we gotta... We gotta screw them all out. Oh, did I just fix it? Nice, I fixed it. Dollar bills! All right, this is uh, all pretty clean, but um, I'm noticing something strange here. If you look at the map, we've got a room over here. We've got a room there, but it's not visible. What? There's a room here. We found a room. Oh my God. So this is what it's hiding. You know, the title of the house was the house that's hiding something. And there's a little room here. Hey, hello there. It's Jelly, how you doing? We, uh, we are extending the house as well, which uh, actually means more dollar bills. So let's just uh, break everything. We're gonna break all these walls. I feel like breaking all the walls is the best thing to do. The bigger the room, the better the room. There we go, keep on breaking the walls. Almost finished. We've just extended this basement like crazy. Very nice, we've got a nice little uh, painting, a nice little couch, and a little table. Well, we're gonna sell these. A thousand dollars for this thing. All right, I'll take it. 123 and... $56,000 for a Van Gogh painting? All right, I guess it's a real one. This game is hiding a Van Gogh? We just bought this house for like $93,000 and there's a Van Gogh in here worth $56,000. Oh my goodness. All right, let's sell it. Woo! Making dollar bills. And that's actually the last thing we had to sell as well because I think we're pretty much finished here apart from breaking this down. Nice. Wow, what a really large basement all of a sudden. All right, let's put this place up for sale. Uh, no matter what price we sell it for, we made an insane amount of profit because of that Van Gogh painting. Wow, not enough rooms. Our future baby needs to live somewhere, right? 78. Okay, we're starting low. This is about $20,000. Oh, we were already in profit. What? $7,000 in profit. $8,000 in profit. $11,000 in profit. 11,000 again. Oh my God. We're making so much money. $12,000 in profit. Come on, give me a good offer. 12,000 again, come on. Let's let's make 20 in profit. 20 in profit should be doable. We sold 58,000 worth of furniture. In the house, we're selling it for 107, so we're $72,000 in profit. You know, we're gonna negotiate. We're gonna add another $5,000 to it because I'm not counting the furniture sales, all right? 
Come on. $5,000 extra. Acceptable. Yes. So much dollar bills. $443,000 on my account. Wow. Well, guys, that's kind of insane. I gotta be honest. Are there any other Van Ghosts anywhere that we can, uh... We can buy and sell, I guess. How did the previous people not know that, that they left a Van Gogh? Are you kidding? So we've got a couple emails as well. We've got one from Caroline Smith, which uh, says, Hello, we need to clean the garage. Please throw away all the boxes, trash, and old tires. Please don't forget to clean the window. It's better not to move my tools. All right, we're going to accept this offer, okay? She's going to want to pay me to clean her garage, but I'm barely going to clean it and see how much money we can make. Oh, okay. I just noticed something. We do have a minimum progress. So I guess we just pick up all the trash. There we go. That took me 22 seconds to pick up all the trash. Uh, our minimum progress is almost there already. That's insane. Uh, let's quickly put these bikes down on a nice way. Like that. We're gonna put the bikes next to each other. Perfect. Perfect. Um, I don't know what else he wanted, to be honest. I guess we could clean it. I guess we clean it and then it's done. How much money will we make of that? Oh my god, someone's been speeding in here. Okay, uh, she did mention clean the windows, so we'll just do that. We'll just clean the windows. Uh, we're done. We've done 100%? What? That took like one minute. Okay, let's try again. We got another email from Amanda. Bonjour. I want my house to look a little bit more arty. Can you please put some paint on the walls? Yes, sure. So what does she want? She just wants paint. Paint on the rooms. And we want some mounts and some devices. Which room, though? Which room does she want? Uh, what? I don't know what to do. Uh, paint rooms. Tasks in other rooms. Which room does she want to paint? There's no task in here. There's no task in here. She wants me to mount a device in here. Okay, which device? I don't know what device she's talking about. Lady, you cray cray. All right, but she says paint with the colors. Maya Rant, Adventure, and Gray. Okay. We'll try that out. Maya. Okay, that's not a thing. Gray. Gray's a thing, of course. Isn't this already gray, though? No, it's not. Okay, so she wants some gray everywhere. We'll give her that. We'll give her that. This is a weird lady. She wants me to mount some devices, but not. She doesn't tell me which devices she wants to mount. Maybe she's talking about an AC or something, but. I don't see anywhere I can, like, attach it to, you know? Are you sure you wanted gray, lady? It's getting a little dark in here, don't you think? Like, seriously. I don't like it. I, li I like the previous color better. The, like, white grayish. All right, well, we're, uh, we're making some progress here. This one's definitely taking a little bit longer, but I hope I get a bigger pay as well. The, the previous one took me, like, a minute. All right, room is pretty much done. Apart from some of the things in the windows. That one... Okay, that's all good, although... Just the window things, I guess. Alright, well that's the paint. Uh, <laughs> wow. She's mentioned something about amaranth something. Let me have a look. If we buy that in the store. Amaranth. Oh, it's actually a color! This is Amaranth Adventure. So which wall does she want in that color? Oh wait, the progress is going down now. What's going back up? I'm really confused. Well, this is what she wanted. <laughs> I'm kind of confused which dev devices she wants to mount, though. What device do you want to mount, lady? I can't say I'm done yet either because the minimum progress isn't high enough. I don't know what she wants me to mount. It just says mount devices. Hello? Which device do you want me to mount? I don't get it. Everything's mounted perfectly fine. Let's, uh, let's, let's paint this one a little bit pink. There you go. Does she want a ceiling fan or something like that? I, I don't get it. I found it! I found it! Oh, it was a broken electrical socket. It was hiding behind a little plant. Well, thank God I found it. Put the wires in. You know, just casually. Don't try this at home, kids. Don't, don't try this at home. Screw it all back together. Put the top on. And we are done with the socket. There you go. So it, it says I've got other tasks to do. I can mount something here as well. I, I just don't see what. But I don't have to, because I, I can done. I, I can be I can say I'm done. $1,200 in the pocket. Mm -mm -mm. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you for watching this house flipper episode. Um I feel like we made the most money in this episode than in any other episode we did. So this is a very successful one. We figured out a way to pretty much make infinite money 
Um, although we are running out of houses. So I don't know if we can do anything else in this game. Um, I, I pretty much completed it. I guess I'm just gonna have to wait until a new house comes out and then figure it out. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. At 10,000 likes, I'll make another episode. Goodbye. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, click on that subscribe button. And also, make sure to check out the new exclusive Jelly Army t-shirts on JellyStore.com.